I think the, the it's a bit what I said before, I think the biggest challenge is the frame of governments, um, the frame that governments use um, to discuss internet issues. So I think a good example is if you look at fake news, a lot of fake news actually is clickbait. So most of the fake news being produced is not much about disrupting uh, elections or I don't know, like being critical towards, towards government or extremism or whatever, but most of it is just trying to spread uh, like an important, like a, a, an extreme message or an interesting message in order to create revenue, to create advertisement revenue. So, and I think to frame these issue in, issues in a securitized way is quite problematic because you're kind of creating these umbrella notions of disinformation and fake news, whereas a lot of times you're talk, just talking about clickbait that's trying to, to create some revenue, right? And I think especially in Western democracies, we have to be very critical towards how our government officials are framing these issues and using it for certain political goals. And I think really, like, keeping the, no, more like protecting the freedom of expression online in the future, that will be the biggest challenge. So what we saw with Macron yesterday, with his speech, it was completely securitized. I mean, it was completely about, we have to like protect ourselves from authoritarianism via censorship. This is kind of the, the, the notion, right? And I think that is, it, it's very, it's a contradiction in itself in a way, and it's a discourse that we have to be very critical of in the future.